I don't know what my ebook could be about. Writing an ebook is harder than it seems. It takes forever to write an ebook. Is that you? You want to write an ebook, but you don't know what to write. Well, in this video, I'm giving you 10 simple ideas for ebooks that you can start and finish in at least one day. Hey guys, my name is Dawn Marie and I am here on YouTube documenting my journey of starting a digital product business from scratch and I will not be using marketplaces like Creative Market or Etsy. Instead, I've built my own website and I'm sharing with you everything I'm doing so that people can get to know about me and eventually buy my products. So you can come along on this journey by following me and please do subscribe to the channel and make sure to check the description box below as I'll leave a link to my last video where I went over my Q1 2023 results so you can see what I get up to. So before I get started, I want to share with you my 10 day action plan for launching your own digital product. You have an idea for an ebook, but you want to know how to sell it. Well, this 10 day action plan is going to take you through everything you need to do for the next 10 days to put together your product, sell and fulfill it. No guesswork needed. So look in the description box below to get started. Okay, so if this is the first time you're seeing me, the digital product that I am selling are marketing templates for people like you who may want to sell your knowledge through info products like ebooks. So that's the topic that I'm going to be covering today, and I want to share with you ebook ideas that you can create today and get started selling today. Now, first of all, what exactly are ebooks? Well, ebooks are books that have been converted to digital formats that can be read on a handheld device or computer screen. So you see this book right here. I can take this book and put it onto a computer document so I can type out everything into a Google document or Word document so that it can be downloaded. And that is what will create an ebook. Now I've said before that ebooks are one of the most easiest digital products that you can create because the tools that you use to create it are free and it simply takes your time to write the content and then package it together. In fact, I already created a video on how to create an ebook step by step using Google Docs and Canva. So link is in the description if you want to check that out, especially if you want to get your first ebook started. That's a resource that you can look at. Now there are so many people out there who who want to write an ebook but they have they don't really know what to write. So I'm hoping that these 10 ideas is going to help give you some inspiration of things that you can actually get started with. And it doesn't have to take that big amount of time, right? You don't need to spend months or years. I've seen people writing ebooks for over two years before they even finish it. So these are ideas that you are able to create in at least one day. So at least you can start packaging it and getting it ready to sell. Now you may have an idea that you want to bring to life and you want to create some written document that you can format into an ebook. But before you do that, since you might feel that there is a certain way that ebooks are supposed to be made, for example, they might need to have X pages or X number of words, I want to tell you that ebooks can come in many different formats. Ebooks can be novels, they can be fiction books where you have a story to tell. You can create a series if you want to. They can come in the form of tutorials, which is mostly what I cover here on this channel. I speak more about info products where you sell your own knowledge through digital products. Ebooks can also um, come in the form of a PDF document. So that's where you are selling a guide or some type of checklist. So I want to give you a few ideas for types of ebooks that you can write and sell so you can get quickly started with your own business. Okay, so the easiest type of ebooks out there are how to ebooks. So these are guides where you take everything that you have in your mind about how to do something and put it into an electronic document, format it and package it into an ebook. So here are a few examples. Maybe you are a dog trainer and you um, can teach people how to train your dog so that it doesn't pull on a leash. That could be an ebook, right? Maybe you know more about floral decoration. Maybe you know about landscaping. You can package that and put that into an ebook. 
So let's break that down even further. Let's say you have 15 steps or ways that people can train their dog so that it doesn't pull on their leash. Then each step can be a chapter in your ebook. Okay, so the other type of ebook that you can create is very similar to a how to guide, and that is an ebook with tips in it. Just simply tips, right? So let's say a, a book with 100 tips for teaching your dogs different tricks that can be broken down into like bite sized paragraphs, and you give quick tips that people, that the user can read that can help them. That there is your ebook. Okay, so what about an ebook for daily routines? So these can be written pretty quickly as they're simply based on a number of activities that the user will have to do throughout the day, right? So for example, you could have a 30 day exercise routine or workout plan for a flat stomach. You can have a seven day routine for affirming good health and wellness. These types of ebooks are typically concise and straightforward. And in my opinion, I think they can be finished in at least one day. Okay, what about a recipe book? I mean, if you love to cook, this type of ebook can include various recipes for maybe a specific cuisine or type of food. For example, you could have 25 delicious vegan breakfast recipes or 30 quick and easy dinner ideas. These can be written really quickly, especially if you already know how to prepare the specific meal. You can just put together a list of ingredients, instructions, and maybe a few personal anecdotes that you have um, used in making these, these recipes. And there you go, another ebook. Okay, so I just covered a few non-fiction books. Let's talk about literature and fiction ebooks. So these are ebooks that allow you to tell a good story. So whether that is a romance ebook, a mystery or thriller, science fiction. I mean, if you're good at writing short stories, then these are great ebooks that you can sit and put together and sell it to people who enjoy reading these types of books. Even a biography or a memoir can be an ebook, right? Many people are fascinated by the lives of others. You can, they can learn from them. They can get insights into how they lived, you know, different things that you can pick out from the lives of other, other people. In fact, with everything that's going on in the world um, right now, I recently purchased a biography of a man who survived the Balkan Wars in the 90s. And, you know, you get to pick out things that he learned and how he, what he did to survive. So it wasn't like he actually wrote his own biography. Somebody actually interviewed him and then created the biography for him. So it's good to know that you can create biographies. You don't have to create a biography about yourself, but someone, but you can do so about someone else. As long as you have accurate information about their life, you can create a biography or memoir. And that is another idea for an ebook. Okay, seventh idea children's ebooks. I mean, you might assume that children don't really read books anymore, but that's quite f far from the truth. I mean, I think parents will continue to buy educational and activity books for their little ones. And you can carve out a niche for yourself, that market to sell those type of ebooks specifically to parents. At the beginning of this video, I spoke about how ebooks do not have to be pages upon pages long. I mean, a lot of people have this misconception that ebooks need to be huge. They really don't. I mean, you can actually have a single page PDF document or a five page document or 10 page document that can be formatted as an ebook and that can actually be a very lucrative product that you can sell. So for example, you can put your knowledge into a document that's less than 10 pages. So for example, you might have ideas of craft patterns, sheet music, DIY instructions. They don't have to be long, but you can at least condense that into, let's say, no more than 10 pages. And there are people who will actually spend money to, act, to, to buy that from you. So it makes their life easier, and especially if they want to um, develop their own skills or knowledge. And talking about the single page PDF or small ebook, let's talk about low content or empty ebooks, right? Like digital planners or journals. I mean, the great thing about these is that they do not specifically rely on a piece of knowledge, but you can create a sequence of pages to help people do something. For example, you might have a budget planner that helps people create budgets or a fitness or meal planner that helps people prepare meals or, or 
prepare a fitness routine those are great types of ebooks you wouldn't imagine that you can just put together a journal or a planner and people will actually buy it and finally my 10th idea for an ebook is an ebook comp compilation so this is where you put together a collection of items so for example you might have a collection of songs collection of poems short stories prayers i mean these are so easy that you can sit in less than a day put these together and get it ready to sell as an ebook okay so out of those 10 ideas has any of them sparked a fire maybe you know your it, it, it um, gives you some ideas of things that you can write let me know in the comments which one you think would be a good idea for you and if you're not quite sure okay so you have an ebook how am i going to sell it then make sure to check out the 10 day action plan that is the step-by-step -step 10 day action plan for launching your own digital product thank you so much guys for watching i really hope this video has helped you and i look forward to seeing you in the next one bye now